Hey everyone, I hope you're having an amazing day. It's Mark Weens. I'm in Accra, Ghana. I'm so excited to be here. We just arrived last night. Uh, and so I thought today, first day, we're just gonna go around. We're gonna eat at a couple of restaurants that I found that look good. I don't really exactly know what I'm doing, but I'm just gonna kind of wing it, see what happens. Uh, definitely I have a first restaurant that I wanna check out. So our ride should be here at any minute. I have a huge plan of doing some street food tours and eating a bunch of Ghanaian food, but this is just the first day uh, I'm just gonna learn, eat, and share it all with you in this video right now. Okay. Hello, Frank. Hello. Hello. All right, we're on our way. How are you today? I'm doing well, sir. I'm very good. Akwaba means not only a welcome, but it's also a greeting. Yes, it's a greeting. When you see somebody. Oh, Akwaba. It's uh, just okay. like a warm welcome to, to wherever the person is coming from. Okay. Like, it could be your wife, your brother, anybody at all, a friend. How do you say delicious? Ayade. 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 Yes. Uh -huh. Ayade. Okay. Sorry. Ayade is a phrase I'm going to need to use a lot <laughs> because I love to eat. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes, Frank. Thank, thank you. you very much. You're welcome, sir. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. Okay, we just got dropped off. This is the spot we're having lunch first. I just love the name of this place. It's called Heavy Dew Chop Bar. What an awesome name. On our way here, I, I had a full conversation with Frank, who drove us here. Such a nice, friendly guy. But so many people in Ghana are so friendly. Even if you meet them for, a first, for the first time, you can have a full conversation. Uh, and almost, I mean, they're almost friends just in a short time. Uh, so yeah, thanks Frank for the ride. We are at Heavy Dew Chop Bar. They got the music blasting. This is a great place. You kind of come back here behind this gate. Are you hungry, Mike Onion? And this is going to be one of my very first meals in Accra, in Ghana so far. So uh, I'm not totally sure all that I'm doing, but just, just bear with me. I'll, I'll do my best and we're going to try to sample especially their signature dish here at Heavy Dew. I'm just loving the atmosphere here already. This is a great place. You ready to eat some Ghanaian food? Oh. That's courtesy of Google Maps. Thank you very much. Uh, but I just showed him that photo. He said, oh yeah, we can get that. I mean, that's from here. Uh, and then I asked him if I could see it being like dished out in the kitchen. He said, yes, come with him. So I'm on the way. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, the food is amazing. Very cool. It's protein. Okay. This is palm nut soup with leaves. Palm ah. nut soup. Palm nut soup. Ah, okay. The aroma of the food. They have all the stews just kind of bubbling away at the front there. You can smell the palm nut oil. You can smell the nuttiness of those stews and those soups. Oh man, this is an awesome place. You can get a variety of different starches and a variety of different proteins and then they put all the soup all over it. Oh man, I'm, I'm hungry. This looks amazing. Hope you're enjoying yourself. It's amazing, yes. I love, I love Ghanaian food. Okay, redfish. Wait, this one is for us? Yeah, okay, okay. I'll just watch as they scoop it inside. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. 
This is a good, a good place. Yeah, very good place. Yeah. He brings it to your table with a plate on top. It's, I think it's in a, I think it's in a clay pan. Uh, but yeah, they loaded it up with the fish, and we got the rice balls. And uh, let's open it and see what else. Got to take off the plate. We got the rice balls on the bottom. Plus, I think he said it's redfish. With they put some vegetables on there, and then they just load it up with that palm nut sauce soup or soup maybe. I'm, yeah. Oh yeah. Man. <laughs> this is rice balls. Rice balls. Oh, okay. I think that's. I think that's what I got. No, no, no. Too. This is banku. Oh, that's banku. Yeah. No, no, are you sure? Oh, okay. Rice balls. Yeah, rice right balls. Okay, rice right balls. And then banku. Uh, that banku. one is banku. Yeah. That's what is banku. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Y
Ebenezer. Ebenezer, okay, yeah. awesome, man. Thank you so much. God bless you. This is one of my first Ghanaian meals ever. And Ebenezer, who served us, is taking care of us. Bye bye. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. It's absolutely great. God bless you. My 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 dasi. 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 Have a great day. So we're going back to the, the house to rest for a little while, and then maybe this evening we'll go eat at another place that specializes in grilled fish, which is pretty close to where we're staying. Just made it back to the house we're staying in. Man, that's the type of meal that you want to take a nap after you eat. It's the late afternoon. We had a nice rest back at the house and we are out now. We just got dropped off. This is a place, it's called Duncan's, but I think Duncan's is the bar on the corner. But we're going for a grilled fish place. Uh, which is right around the corner from Duncan's. Uh, but I think most people just call it Duncan's. Oh, the place is actually called Lolonio Tilapia Fish. What time will you open? At six o'clock. Oh, not at five? Unfortunately, they are not open yet. I was hoping they'd be open by 5 p.m., but they said they open at 6 p.m. That's about an hour away, so uh, maybe we'll just hang out kind of around here and wait. Uh, but. Yeah, we're getting kind of sleepy because I'm still pretty, we're all still pretty jet lagged. We're pretty sleepy, uh, but we'll wait. That, it, it looks like an amazing place. They're lighting up the charcoal and they're scaling. They're taking the scales off the tilapia now uh, in abundance. They're, 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 they're preparing for some serious tilapia. We walked around for a little while and we're back right at 6 p.m. But they're, they're kind of slowly still setting up, not, not fully set up yet. The charcoal's still going, but that's all right. It will be coming soon. So we sat down and we're gonna wait on the fish. Yeah, I think it's about 6.30 now. They are putting the first batch of fish onto the grill. You can smell the garlic maybe. Um, it smells unbelievably good. Uh, and this place is known for their grilled tilapia. And you, yeah, they're, they're setting up a couple of barrel grills. It smells so good. Uh, and then I know they serve it with some of the sauces, with some of the, the onions and tomatoes and some other sauce. Uh, but well, yeah, we're, we're getting ready to eat it. They're still gr grilling the fish, but they're kind of like slow grilling, just smoking away. They should be ready very soon. We got two fish. Thank you. Mega. Mega. Got my own light. <laughs> What is the what is the chili sauce called? Pepe. pepe. Oh, okay, pepe. Pepe. Okay, good. What's? Yes, it's chili and tomato. Chili and tomato and what else? Mostly chili and tomato. An onion. Okay. Okay, great. Thank you. Well, I think it was well worth the wait. Uh, it's tilapia and yeah, they grilled it and then they covered it in a sauce and then they served it with a bunch of tomatoes and onions and I think it's called pepe which is the, uh, it's, uh, it's almost like a, a salsa of tomato, onions and peppers and chilies in there uh, and it's just roasted to perfection. We also got, uh, Mama hooked us up with a, uh, a little bit of banku which is the starch to eat with this. It, it smells incredible. Ah, I'm very excited. It looks awesome. 
I'm gonna dig into that fish from this side, kind of scoot those tomatoes over. Oh, you can feel how juicy it is. Oh, and yeah, this is hot. This is right off the grill. Uh, oh, 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 the juiciness. Get a little bit of that, and I gotta dip it into that, that pepe. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, that fish, it's really juicy, it's really smoky, it's really salty, but that saltiness is what makes it so good, paired with that that grilled roasted flavor. Mm, and that, that, that pepe is amazing. It's a little bit spicy, um, but it's the type of combination of ingredients that kind of like zings your tongue a little bit. Maybe because it's so salty and also just so, the chilies, the tomatoes in there, the onions, it sort of sizzles on your tongue just a little bit. Mm. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, take some mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah that's great. Taking a video of the food. I got some ginger in that bite. Oh, oh, that's good. Okay, let's try some of the banku. And banku is a is a popular Ghanaian starch. Um, I believe that it's fermented fermented corn and then made into a a mash. That's quite a quite a ball of it. Grab some of this, and this is what's popularly served with the fish. Okay, and I'm gonna dip some more into that, into that fish with some of the banku, and, and some of that, that pepe over there. Mm. The banku is really sticky. It has a sour taste to it, but it's really smooth as well. It's incredibly good. No wonder this place has such a reputation for serving some of the best. Mm -hmm. The combination of the tilapia with the onions and tomatoes and that pepe, that's just the ultimate combination. That's, that's wonderful. It's a harmony of flavors in your mouth. I'm loving it, every single bite of it. It's been an, a, an amazing first day in Accra. The food has been delicious. The people that we've interacted with and hung out with and met just in two meals today uh, have been so friendly and so welcoming and, and so like, like joyful. Uh, and the food lunch was absolutely an insanely delicious meal. This fish is delicious. Uh, and yeah, this is just my, my first time to try Ghanaian food in Accra. So there's gonna be a lot, you, you can expect to see a lot more Ghanaian food coming up. So be sure to stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you turn on your bell notifications so that you get notified of the next video. But lots more Ghanaian street food and local food coming your way. Uh, yeah, I, I have some great plans coming up for you that I'm gonna share with you. Uh, and I think that's it. We're just gonna enjoy this fish and then we're heading back. Yeah, we're, we're still very jet lagged. We just got here yesterday. So we're all feeling quite tired. So we're gonna go back to sleep. Uh, so thanks again for watching this video. Please remember to give it a thumbs up and again, subscribe for lots more videos, food and travel. Thanks again for watching. I will see you on the next video. Good night from Accra in Ghana.